737 right now as those votes roll in. William Patterson University is holding its own election watch party. News 12 New Jersey's Rick Holmes joins us from that watch party up there in Wayne. Rick. <laughs> Hey, Dell, you know, this is a really great experience to be out here because these are the millennials who are voting for their first, maybe their second time if they were 18 in high school. But uh, this is one of the campus dormitories. This is Whitehall on the campus of William Patterson University. They're going to walk down these stairs and come right into this room. And the first stop they're going to make is this table. They're signing in, not just to sign in their names, but this is also where they're getting credit for some civic engagement classes so they can get their beads, they can get their lays here, kind of like Mardi Gras, and then they can get their credits as well. They can also get a flag. Thank you, Cheyenne. We appreciate that. We're going to be seeing a lot of these tonight. Then they're going to come over here, and this is where they're having their mock election tonight. These are the ballots you can see here. You've got Clinton, you've got Kane, or you've got Trump, and you've got Pence, but there's also a ballot for the other parties, the Green Party, the Libertarian Party, and they'll be voting as the night goes on to see how this room leans tonight. Now, it is a college campus. You think that Hillary Clinton will have a lot of supporters here, but this is also Wayne, which is a town that tends to um, lean a little bit Republican, so you might have a nice mix here in that room, and that's definitely what we have here tonight. I want to talk with Mirabel Rodriguez, who's kind of coordinating this with all the students here tonight. Just tell us about how, how you came up with this idea and why it's important for these millennials, these first or second time voters. Well, here at William Patterson, we are the only university that requires students to take classes in civic engagement. And this room's filled tonight. I mean, take a yes, look at all this. Yes, we definitely have an amazing turnout here. We want our students to be civically engaged. We want them to know the importance of the election process. And we had this event here so we can offer them a place to have discussions, meet other students, and do participate in our mock election. And it's going to be a while until this election is uh, determined tonight. Thank you very much, Ms. Rodriguez. But you can see this room is just packed. The uh, voting will take place. There's already some ballots in, kind of like early voting. But tonight at 9, they'll have the full election. And we'll be, we'll be here. We'll talk to some of the kids here tonight, some of the students, and give you the results of that election as well. And that's the latest here at William Patterson University in Wayne. We'll send it back to you.